Today on our 2008 Jeep Compass, we'll be installing the Kurt trailer hitch, part number 13548. Here's what our hitch looks like installed on our vehicle. Now we'll go ahead and give you a couple measurements and helping you choose some accessories for your hitch, such as a ball mount, a bicycle rack, or a cargo carrier. From the top of the opening in the receiver to the ground is approximately 14 inches, and from the center of the hitch pin hole to the outermost edge of the bumper is approximately 4.5 inches. Now let's go ahead and install our hitch. Here's where the four attachment points that we'll be using on the vehicle to attach our hitch. The hardware we will be using is a hex bolt, a flat washer, and a hex flange nut. All four locations will use the exact same hardware. Before we can put our hitch up, we'll need to lower two rubber exhaust hangers down out of the way. Before we can do this, we want to put a safety strap in place to help support the exhaust once these rubber hangers have been removed. Now that our safety strap's in place, we'll go ahead and use a little spray lubricant and a pry bar to work the two rubber hangers off of their holders. Now that these two are off, we can go ahead and lower the exhaust down a little bit out of our way. Now it's a good idea to go ahead and get an extra set of hands to help you put the hitch up into place. It also helps if you go ahead and put all four of the bolts and flat washers in place, but don't push them all the way through the frame. That way, as you raise the hitch up into place, you can go ahead and push all four bolts in and it'll support the hitch. Now with all four flange nuts in place, we'll go ahead and tighten things down and then torque it to the manufacturer's specification. With the hardware torqued, we can go ahead and reinstall the exhaust hangers. With the exhaust back up into place, we'll go ahead and remove the safety strap. And with that, that'll conclude our installation of the Kurt Hitch part number 13548 on our 2008 Jeep Compass.